Garrett Metal Detectors, the worldwide leader in metal detection. Sports and entertainment venues like the Air Canada Centre should be places where fans can escape their day-to-day -day concerns and take in a concert or a hockey game. I recently spoke to Vince Bozzo, General Manager at Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment, about some recent changes at the ACC designed to make sure fans can continue to enjoy these pastimes in a safe and secure environment. Well, the evolution of security for the ACC has been mandated by both of our leagues, the NHL and the NBA. Through the years, it's been enhanced with the result of certain things that have happened either on the court or on the playing surface or with world events. So you've seen the addition of a number of different things. First, it started with the physical, the barriers to prevent people from driving into the building. Then after you had the physical barriers, you started to go to enhanced training methods. After the training methods, you started to introduce elements like the wands. And this year, for the first time, both the NBA and the NHL have teamed up together and we're instituting walkthroughs. So every NBA and NHL venue will have walkthroughs that will be in place for every game. And the best thing about it was they partnered and they went out and found the three best suppliers in North America that could provide us with the equipment at the NHL and NBA preferred rate. So the benefit to that was we didn't have to institute it for one team in one year and then the next team the next year. That happened with dog searches, which was about three or four years ago. First it was the NBA, then the NHL. And the wands went 100% for the NBA first and then the NHL followed a couple years later. Because the last thing you want to do is confuse your fans. If they arrive here for an NHL or an NBA game, they want to be treated the exact same. There are certain artists, and we would never know for certain, that might have risks that we're unaware of. So their head of security will meet with us in advance and tell us this is what we'd like to see, whether it's searches, whether it's pat-downs, or if it's a type of show where they don't require it. We try our best to accommodate both the fans and also the artists in that. So we try to delicate balance between customer service for what we'd like to do for the promoter and the production of the show, but also to make sure that our 20,000 fans that are coming to watch it are not going to experience anything negative. When we had to institute the wands for security checks, we had an amazing security officer who utilized it like a baton. We actually had little kids who'd come to Raptor games every single game with their family and would sit and watch him for over five minutes just because he was the cool part of the show. We do routine tasks every day. We make sure fans come and go safely. We make sure we have the best food products available for our food and beverage. But those staff that do that little thing like that completely change the night for a fan who's coming. I mean, if you think about it, it's a horrible task that you have to search someone who's walking in the building. But for that security officer to think outside the box and say, how am I going to do this in a way that's going to make them want to come in my line? It's just, it literally goes above and beyond. And it's those messages like that that truly make a difference in what we do. 